Welcome to the APY Guy channel. If you like passive income and you like low market cap gems that can possibly do 100x in a bull market, you're going to love this channel. So make sure you subscribe to it. Drop a like on this video. I'd greatly appreciate it. Nothing in this video or on this channel is financial advice. I am not a financial advisor. Please do your own research. I am extremely excited to take a new turn on my channel and do some technical analysis. Uh, a guy that I think is very good at it and we're going to do a lot of collaborations in the future. Uh, Abe, uh, say hi to the APY Guy channel um, community. Thank you very much APY for inviting me over and for this collaboration, okay? Um, today we're gonna be seeing some BTC, what do you think? Uh, Bitcoin, I think, is uh, doing pretty well. It's retesting 42,460. I think it might come back down and test the lows. If it does retest the lows, what are the lows going to be? I would say probably at least this trend line here, the purple trend line that's coming down. And uh, we're on the one hour now. That would be the 50 EMA around 41,720. What do you think, Abe? Um, I would say the same if you go down to 15 minutes um, you see the train line popping out right now too you can see that it's gonna go around the 42 ish yeah I think so I think yeah, you're absolutely correct on that uh, there's a trend line there the 50 EMA on the uh, 15 minute is right around it's gonna be around forty two thousand dollars when it gets there yeah um, we should probably look at a couple altcoins here too because there's been some hot ones and uh, we've been doing really, really well on some of these gaming coins. Uh, we'll take a look at those in a second. Before we get into the altcoins, uh, it looks like Bitcoin's retesting that resistance and that trend line at uh, 42, uh, 42,650 in that area. Yeah, around the area. Yeah, so let's go with um, some altcoins. I don't know where my altcoins are. They're there. Too many of them. One of the ones that's been intriguing over the last few, I guess, months is INJ. This thing is a beast. If you look at this, it keeps testing that trend line. If you bought it at support and you sold at resistance, you're a baller. I didn't. That's for sure. I'm not that good. But what do you think about that, Abe? I think you're right with that. I didn't either, <laughs> so I couldn't. <laughs> but look at that. Isn't it? crazy to see if we go out to the four hour it's a little different story yeah. but if you just bought and sold the one hour look at that you oh, yeah. you would be a, a billionaire no i'm just kidding but i just think this is one of the better coins i like going forward ing that's yeah. right I mean, right now injective you... protocol does anybody know what it actually does i do because i cover it on the apy guy channel so if you were watching my channel you would know exactly what injective protocol was. Okay. okay, now we're gonna check out Ethereum on the one hour. Right now it's above the 50 EMA. It's above um, support. It's running into some resistance, probably at 22.59 or so. Uh, what do you think, Abe? Um, I think the same, um, it's gonna find some resistance, but it, for sure it's gonna start going up in any minute. Yeah, I think... So I think uh, it's at a good spot right now. Uh, it could get, uh, there's a trend line right here that it could go at 2220 possibly. It could get re, uh, resistance and maybe come back down here and test that um, EMA and then go back up. That's right. There's a lot of coins that look pretty good right now. Uh, we're gonna go to AVAX, that's one of our favorites lately. Yeah. Okay, we got a falling wedge on the AVAX. We'll call it a pizza slice, we'll call it whatever you wanna call it. We're gonna call it AVAX is breaking out here. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, you know, TA is all about probabilities. So we're probability calling this is going to be a breakout, maybe. So I'm gonna break a trend line here. I'm gonna bring this trend line all the way down, this big white trend line all the way down. I'm gonna click here. And if you wanna call it a falling wedge or whatever, you know, TA's people call it, it broke out, but it is going to get resistance at $41. K 
can it go up to 45? I think so. it's a good probability. It is um, a really good probability. What do you think there, Abe? Yeah, I mean, if you go to a four hour chart. Let's um, go to four hour. Yeah, you can see the jewel it's starting to come up to. The jewel is breaking out of oh, my yeah. trend line too. Look at that trend line that I drew. This trend line I drew probably a long time ago. It was probably weeks ago on the four hour. It's broken out. So it could go, you know, at least to $43. I would say it's a good buy, you know, now. In my opinion, not financial advice, but I am in a AVAX long right now. And worst case scenario, it comes back and uh, tests the uh, 50 EMA at $38.54, and it's definitely a buy. What other coins do you want to cover today, Abe? Uh, we can look at Beam. Beam? Yeah. Okay, we're looking at Beam. B-E-A-M on the uh, one hour. I'm seeing Beam is up on the one hour. It's getting pretty high up there, the 80% mark. But on the four hour, it looks a little different. It's turning up. Uh, there's not a lot of charts out on Beam. It's a very newer coin. It was, if you watch this channel, Merit Circle was the original company. It turned into Beam, and then Beam is now going to be a gaming project which I'm loving gaming projects. And this is one of the ones that Alex Becker himself has uh, brought into Neo Tokyo. Uh, what do you think about Beam there? Well, if you look at one hour right now, um, you can see it's trying to push up, but um, it's kind of having a little difficult to it. Um, if you see the 200 EMA, it's also using a set resistance. Um, I think it might come down somewhere around um, 0 0.01927 what do yeah, you think? Yeah, it could possibly. It looks like there's some selling pressure. A lot of times when you see those wicks on top um, of green candles, that's selling pressure. Uh, I think it can go up to 2.2 cents. Uh, it's in a falling kind of wedge scenario if you want to look at it the same way as some of the other coins that we're looking at today. I think a lot of this is bullish structure. I think a lot of it can come down a little further, but at the same time, a lot, there's not, I don't see anything bearish about a lot of these coins that I like. Uh, I'm very bullish on gaming coins in general. Abe spotted this one out earlier. Uh, Super looks really good right now. It's one of the <laughs> coins that we've been bullish on. Uh, it's one of the projects that's uh, Elio Trades project. I think they're gonna do some pretty cool stuff with gaming. But right now, it just broke trend. It's above the 50 EMA on the one hour. It's retesting some uh, some support here. I think it can go up to, is 63 cents possibly, if Bitcoin stays, you know, bullish. Uh, what do you think, Abe? I think the same thing. I mean, if you see the jewel, you see it's turning up too. It hasn't gone down. Yes. And um, do you see the 50 MA too? I mean, it's using a support, support. Everything looks really bullish right now. Yeah, and it looks like it's gonna break the 50 EMA on the two hour. Uh, what What is the four hour doing? Let's check. Oh, the four hour jewel is turning up right now. It's really low. It's uh, at like 25% on the scale of the jewel, that's definitely a good sign. I think uh, Super looks like a, it's in a good spot. Okay, we got another banger for you. Uh, FET, Fetch, it's an AI coin. Uh, it's one we've been trading for a while. It's got nothing stopping it. Like literally, it has nothing, no resistance to like almost 75 cents. Uh, a, what do you think of this one? I mean, I think it's gonna rampage right now, man. <laughs> it's it's going very bullish right now. No resistance, nothing above 50 and 200 EMA, and the jewel is also turning up, man. Yeah, I think this one. If we even go further and go to the eight hour, the eight hour is turning up. So this is probably going to 75 cents. What is the all-time high on Fed? We're gonna find out here in a second. I'm gonna go to the weekly. I'm not even sure. Oh, it's, it's been higher. It's been way higher. But uh, it's above resistance, old resistance uh, on the weekly. So I think Fed is at a good spot, not financial advice, but in my opinion, I think 
this will probably get up to close to 75 cents. Hey, what's going on with the H-Bar? looks like it broke out, no? All right, man, um, we have one of these, um, your favorite partners, the Pixel one. Uh, we got the Fallen Wedge, it's breaking through too. Yes. Um, you see it's going through that uh, resistance right now. What you say, it's gonna go up to resistance around 83? What do you think? Uh, 8.1 cents is where it's gonna get some big resistance. I'm gonna go to the two hour. It broke out of the two hour too, and it's, uh, I don't know it's it's tough because if you look at it if it breaks above 8.1 cents it's gonna go almost 8.8 .8 cents if Bitcoin lets it um, if we go to the four hour the four hour jewel is turning up hardcore right there yeah let's see if it the six hour is doing oh boy that could be huge that could go all the way up to 8.8 .8 cents okay this is the last coin we're covering as HBAR because we want to get this video out for you guys. Uh, I think we did a pretty good job breaking this down. I want to thank again Abe for uh, coming over and helping me do this video. I think we're going to collaborate like this in the future a lot. Uh, I think this is good for people to just see trend lines and just see really easy technical analysis and how it works or doesn't work. So what we'll do is we'll go over our video that we made today and our next video and see what, you know, what we failed on or what we, you know, accomplished or what we won on. Hopefully we'll win on 75% of our trades. I hope so. That'd be great. Um, this is another reason that I think I bring out a lot of value for my channel. I'm going to start doing more of these videos with the technical analysis. Uh, if you want to subscribe, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, I do farming staking videos. If this is your first time seeing the channel with the uh, technical analysis, then I do a lot more on this channel. Uh, so, uh, as always, thank you for watching. Abe? Uh, thank you for inviting me over, man. I appreciate it a lot, okay? Uh, no problem, man. It was, a, it was a pleasure having you. So, as always, thank you for watching and have a great day.